Right, that's the end of my Easter weekend. I've uh, done quite a bit, not got where I want to do, but that seems to be part of the course these days. Um, moved some stuff out of the uh, pots into bigger pots, so I'm pleased about that. Planted out some red cabbage and some gherkins into these larger pots here. And my tomatoes are ready to put on into bigger pots as well. Um, I've overdone it with the courgettes. I've uh, I planted myself about four courgettes because we had two last year and that did us. But then there's a Portuguese family on there a lot that come up here yesterday and give me three courgettes. So I've now got too many. Don't know what to do with them. I'll have an ask on the plot, see if anyone wants them. There's some more of my tomato plants, so as I say, I've overdone it with them, but um, it's not a big deal because there are people I know I can give them to. So uh, that's one of me, that's me run of bean, one of me run of beans. I've moved into a bigger pot. I understand there's going to be a frost this week, so I'm sort of reluctant to plant anything out. So, uh, some more tomato plants. There's a cucumber. Um, this is my celeriac, which is so tiny, I don't know if it's right. And a lot of it died off. They had a hell of a root on them, so I've put them into bigger pots uh, just to see how they come out. Um, my cucumbers, some more cucumbers there, which are almost ready to. Uh, plant out and uh, I've got some cow and cucumber melons in the middle there so we're doing all right on that and there's my surplus courgettes um, or three there which will I'll put to a good home um, and butternut squashes which will be planting out when I've got a couple more leaves on them uh, so yeah so that's about as far as it goes with the update there's some Brussels down there which I'm going to be planting out but again as I say I'm hanging on oh I've got some mushrooms down here. Oh, I meant to check them. The missus did breakfast. Oh yeah, they're ready. The missus did breakfast this morning and then remembered that we had some mushrooms. She bought this box when she went to visit her mother recently. And it's uh, sort of comes with a lid, it's all all uh, all inclusive. And I know it wasn't dear, it was uh, my missus is close to a pound note. But um, yeah, so she sent brought me this back and uh, I thought I'd give it a go. And I've just, I know I looked in there the other day and I had a couple of little white heads poking through. But uh, look in here, we've got a few there. So uh, I'll take them back to her, she'll, she'll be happy about that. I don't know how you, I've got a feeling you cut these off because I'm just pulling up a lump of root there. So, I oh know, that's come up alright. My missus used to pick mushrooms when she was a kid uh, as a Saturday job. She said you just pull them up, you don't have to do anything with them. But... It's big and oh, seems to have taken after the medium with it, but yeah. So there we go, four mushrooms harvest, harvested, and I've also um, managed to get some rhubarb off the plot as well. Um, the daughter's cracked on with the um, the flower plot today, which is good. After putting a bit of guilt guilt trip on her, walking around with a limp and that, and she eventually takes a hint and she's uh, she's had a uh, she's weeded it and started planting. But unfortunately it's raining out there now so there's not much else going to be done today. I've thinned out the uh, rhubarb. Um, I have planted um, a squash that the Portuguese family gave me and one of my cucumbers. That was before I found out we were in for some, some frost. So, uh, so I've had assistance today. Luckily not from the Labrador but from my daughter. I'm not sure which one's brighter but I know one is probably less aggravation sometimes. And of course this is one of the problems of me trying to get work done with my dog's up here. He's nicked me knee pads. I'm just about to do some weeding up on the top around my onions and he's picked up me flipping knee pad. Give us that here you. Give me that here. Give us that here. Give... And there it becomes a, becomes a game. I don't know get much done. Look at him, butter will melt in his mouth. Give me that knee pad back you. Give us it here. Hey! Don't you shake. Give us it here. Give us it here, you little bastard. Come on, back here. Wait, I'll have to get brutal. I'm going to turn the camera off while I do that. 
and I turn me back and the git got me flipping noobing pad again. Give us it here. <laughs> this ain't a game. Well, uh, looks like that bit of violence didn't work. I hope they get the knives out. Right, that'll do us for one day. Uh, I've just tidied up the onion bed at the front. Still a lot to do, this grass seems to be coming from everywhere. But uh, it didn't help with uh, the dog who kept nicking me kneeling pad. Uh, at one point he was trying to drag me off the kneeling pad while I was actually on it. But uh, I don't know what goes on in his mind half the time. The rest of the stuff's coming up alright. Uh, I'm a bit. Um, everything else is going alright. I put out some courgettes down there. This was a. This climbing frame had poles right the way along, but uh, I didn't really need it, to be honest. We don't eat a great deal of beans, and uh, you know, there's enough there with uh, 10 canes for me to uh, get what we need. Wait, give us that back. Give us it here. Uh, he's got the devil in him, and I'll have a job calming him down, I think. Must have been on the Harry Bow, I reckon. But uh, yeah, I've stuck some leaks in in between the frames. I've never done them before. Mind you, I've never done much before, but uh, we'll see how they work out. And I've seed, put some seeds in for the, the frames as well, for some runners. Uh, Portuguese family over here, Antonio and his wife and niece, give me some courgettes, so I've got plenty growing in the garden, in the greenhouse. But uh, I planted them out yesterday, they're a little more developed than mine. Um, this bed here, I'm going to plant me, uh, me squashes. I've got some... Uh, some pumpkins and some, uh, I think I've got some marrows actually, so I'll plant them out as well. Um, the next job on here is clearing up these pea frames um, and putting some netting in so that I can uh, grow some peas and cucumbers along there. That'll do you for now.